everyone and welcome back. Today let's see how packaging is done in Odo 14. So basically there are three types of packaging in Odo 14. First one uh, is, is to create a pack for a particular product that can contain multiple units. So in this way you can create multiple pack packets for a product. Then second case is to create a pack that contains different products. Then third case is all about delivery package. So let's go through these three types in detail. So let's take sales module. And in sub which choose a product. You can find value there. Okay. Then edit it under inventory tab. You can find an option to set packaging. So from here by adding line you can add the pack name so I'm adding pack of 10 uh, so I'm creating a pack for this product that contains 10 units so I can add the contain quantity then if I wish to add the barcode for the product it can be given to identify the uh, it is for packaging identification then you can you can add a company specific company I am not adding it because I want to apply this package for all companies. So after that you can save this. In the same way you can create new pack. Different pack. Let me pack of 5. Okay, I am adding, changing the unit as 5. I am saving it. So I have created two packages, packs for this, packaging for this product. After that save this. Now let us create a sale order for this product. And can see field that is package. So two, two packages as packages can be seen that is provided inside the configuration of the product. So when you choose one, you can see a warning showing that this product is packaged by 10 units. So you should, you should sell 10 units. So this is shown in order to change the quantity to be really good. Okay. Now let's, if you wish to confirm, you can confirm this. So you can see mm, the unit price is changed. According to the quantity, you can see it is 470 now because 10 quantities now let's create another sale order so this is the second case where we can pack multiple products products in one pack one package so let's add some products here Okay, I have added two products with some quantities. After that, let's confirm it. And let's go to delivery. Here you can see an option button that is to put in pack. So these products, if you click on this, you can put those products in a pack. So if you edit you can create a new pack from here itself or otherwise you can put, put these products in a existing package so I have created a package then after that You can click put in pack 
so here you can see packages so this is a pack that we have created and if you open this you can see some details like package type shipping weight then company owner location package usage that is whether this is a disposable disposable box or reusable box then after validating the delivery you will be able to see the product and the other along with that other details so let's validate this valid delivery and after that you can see that these products have been added to the content so you can also find this in inventory module where we have packages under products menu and if you open this you can find our package so it's okay so this is our package here you can find our products so this is the second case now let's see third case that is about delivery package so if you click on this you can see page to create new delivery package so if you click create button you can add a package name so before that we have to add some carriers So uh, before you can see the delivery package uh, in inventory only when delivery package is enabled. So here I have added the shipping connectors and save this. After that, come back to delivery package. So you can see a lot of delivery package here. Okay, this is our package. Here you can see some carriers like P post. DHL and all you can if you wish you can select one then you can mention you can tell the height of this package delivery package then width then length then maximum weight barcode can be set for this delivery package then package code also can be given After that, one thing you can see is that in package, here you can see package type. So you can add Here you can see delivery package one that we have created. You can add the delivery package. And save this. So this is how delivery package can be created. So that's all about different packaging ways in Odo 14. If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any order implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to 
ஓடுவாட் சாய்ப்ரோசிஸ்